The main purpose of fasting is to develop or improve your spiritual connection with God. For you to get the best out of Ramadan, you need to go into Ramadan in a good spiritual state. So, here are six practical tips to help prepare for Ramadan spiritually. Tip number one, supplicate to God. You want to increase your spiritual connection with God, right? Want to have a blessed Ramadan? So ask God on a regular basis to grant you this. Remember, God is the only one who has the ability to do this. Tip number two, learn about Ramadan. Seeking knowledge about what makes this month special and the virtues of it will help to motivate you to begin preparing spiritually. Tip number three, listen to the Quran. One of the best methods to increase your spiritual state is to attach yourself to the Quran. After all, Ramadan is the month of the Quran. You may not be an Arabic reader yet, so start listening to the Quran on a regular basis while reading the translation. Verily in the remembrance of God do hearts find rest. Tip number four, make a Ramadan plan. Set yourself goals for Ramadan. Keep those goals realistic and don't compare yourself to other Muslims. You are new, so take it easy. Then list habits you want to develop or destroy to achieve these goals on a Ramadan plan. Visit our Ramadan blog for templates you can use and ideas of goals and habits to set. Tip number five, start working on habits now. You have made a list of habits you want to work on in Ramadan. Don't expect to click into new habits or stop bad habits on day one of Ramadan. Start working on these habits now. Tip number six, be around good people. Spend time with those Muslims who are active in preparing for Ramadan. This will help increase your spiritual state as the Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, said, a man is upon the religion of his best friend. So let one of you look at whom he befriends. If you don't have any Muslim friends to keep in touch with, not to worry. This is what Islam wise are here for. Reach out to us and we will keep in touch, God willing. We hope you find these tips useful in preparing for Ramadan and share with others. Please visit our Ramadan blog now and share your tips, advice and experiences, good or bad, so other new Muslims can benefit this Ramadan.